Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt. If you're new here, this is a face of whiskey and smarts and entertainment. And if you don't like it, then you're not going to like what's about to happen. Because it's all about this. And whiskey and entertainment. So, it's steaming hot outside. Sun's beating down on your gigantic body. You are sweating profusely and you cannot stop. You have a sweating problem and you refuse to address it. The only way you could address it would be to go inside of an air conditioned room and just stand in front of the air conditioner like this. Until it got to be nighttime, the sun went down and you sweated yourself to sleep. But you want to enjoy a whiskey. Now, the whiskeys I typically enjoy, typically, in a typical day, are high proof, just boiling sons of bitches that'll just scorch my taste buds into an ever loving love fest of hotness and love and hot. But, but in the scorching heat of summer, in the scorching heat of July and August, when, when the rays are beating down, just burning you, and you want you want to drink a bourbon on those days? You want to drink a whiskey on those days? Are you crazy? Yeah, maybe you are. Or maybe you just like whiskey. These are my top three, maybe four whiskeys that you can enjoy on those summer days when you feel like maybe water is a better idea. What are you talking about? Water is never a better idea, but I'm not a doctor, so don't take that as medical advice. Bourbon's always a good idea, and so is other whiskeys. Whiskey is always a great idea. Whiskey is amazing. First pick, coming in hot. Eight in sand. This is a blended MGP bourbon. It says so right here. Blended bourbon whiskey. It has a train on it because choo-choo coming through with deliciousness. My dad actually gave me this bottle. Um, as a gift for my birthday. So thank you, Dad. I love you very much. And I have enjoyed this and I will continue to enjoy it. This comes from Indiana. It is a blended bourbon whiskey. What that means is in this bottle is a bunch of different MGP whiskeys. The reason they can call this a blended bourbon whiskey is because the majority of this bottle the majority of this blend is is MGP bourbon. Also in the son of a bitch is MGP rye whiskey, MGP corn whiskey, and MGP light whiskey. But the majority of it is bourbon whiskey. Therefore, they can call it a blended bourbon whiskey. This sucker comes in at 88 proof. It has a train, so you know that you will be just on the tracks, headed straight for your summer destination of, of, of just delightfulness of drinking and yum yum. This is good straight and also good on the rocks. America, wow, that's a good pop. This is so good. Actually, I've had this in the summertime with my dad on the rocks and it is very good. It's also good neat and I'd imagine it's probably good with a little bit of water and who knows, if you want to mix it with something, go ahead do it. A good, a good go-to whiskey for those summer months. The proof isn't going to burn you out, but the flavor will keep you coming back for more. My second, number two, go-to whiskey for the summer months is this son of a mother. Old Forster Rye, a delicious summertime rye whiskey, 100 proof, sweet. America. First of all, if this bottle of whiskey isn't on your shelf already, if this isn't bunkered away, if this isn't on your bar already, Old Forester Rye, then you're a blithering idiot. But if you're looking for a good rye whiskey for the coming, for the upcoming summer months, Old Forester Rye might just be that guy. Oh yeah. It's a hundred proof, but doesn't drink like it. It drinks a little bit softer than that. It has bourbony notes and rye notes. It, it's a little bit different than most rye whiskeys, but it is different in a good way. Something that you could enjoy on a hot summer day and not be overwhelmed by the heat, 
but also a little bit refreshed by a little bit of minty floralness on the palate. A little bit of minty goodness, a little bit of minty sweetness, and a little bit of minty coolness. Old Forster Rye is a fantastic, fantastic rye whiskey that I would imagine will just make you smile and think about me. Because look at me. Right? The best summertime whiskey on the planet. Old Forester single barrel bourbon whiskey. The bottle is super sexy. You could probably turn on an entire cheer squad with this bottle because it is black and gold and it is shaped very curvaceous and beautifully. It has a cork, it is 90 proof, and it is very tasty. These single barrel bottles will vary by bottle to bottle because they are single barrels and they are they are picked you know, by groups and by stores. But they're, the ones I've had have all been tremendous and they're all very sweet. They're all very banana-like and they're all very cherry-like. Fourth of July, it's hot. It, you're just like sweating a little bit, but you kind of want to celebrate the fourth with a bit of bourbon. America, fireworks. You pour yourself some Old Forster single barrel. And you're like, oh, wow. That smells fantastic. That smells delicious. It smells wonderful. And then the person that you're on the date with for the 4th of July is like, what are, are you talking about me? And you're like, oh yeah, babe, you also smell delicious and wonderful and tasty and delicious and wonderful and tasty and stuff. But I was not talking about my whole Forester single barrel. The 90 proof is nice and mellow, but it's also gonna provide a flavor bomb from Flavor Town. You know, Flavor Town, USA. Oh. Such a such a glorious, such a glorious whiskey. This Old Forester single barrel. If I were to leave the house to go to the beach, or to go to a Fourth of July, or to go to a friggin' parade, I would say that I would probably bring, in the heat of summer, an Old Forester single barrel. This is my number one go-to summer whiskey for the, the summer of 2020. Now, breaking news. Breaking news. These are going away though. These are going away. Why are they going away? Because they're going into a 100 proof and a barrel proof single barrel program. So the 90 proof, the 90 proof single barrels are going away. But there are plenty of these out there to find right now. So going into summer 2020, you'll be able to find a whole slew of these. Um, so buy them and drink them all summer. And then when the fall rolls around, the new single barrels, the 100, and 100 proof barrels, and the barrel proof barrels will be your best friends come fall time. But enjoy these all summer. My wild card summer whiskey pick. If you can't find those, um, you, sh you could probably find this. It's a 100 proof Rebel Yell. It's weeded, it's sweet, it is good to go. Throw it on some ice if you have to in the summertime. Um, throw it on some Coca-Cola if you're a bitch. Or just drink it neat if you're a gangster like me. Rebel Yell Hunter Proof. Underrated bourbon in general. Buy this. Rebel Yell Hunter Proof. Buy the Old Forester Single Barrel. Buy, buy the Old Forester Single Barrel. Buy the Old Forester Rye. And buy the eight and sand. For sure, do that. My name is Matt, this is ADHD Whiskey, and like I always say, keep your head in the clouds, but your mind on staying cool and hammered in the summertime.